You know your lungs can hold about six liters of air. That's right. Lung capacities are the volumes of air our lungs can handle during different phases of breathing. Today, we will try to learn about the lung capacities. Firstly, lung capacity is the combination of at least two volumes. Now we'll see the types. There are five lung capacities. Inspiratory capacity, functional residual capacity, expiratory capacity, total lung capacity. Now we'll take the first two volumes. That is, tidal volume and the inspiratory reserve volume, both combining called the inspiratory capacity. A combination of tidal volume, inspiratory reserve volume, and the expiratory reserve volume called the vital capacity. Expiratory reserve volume and residual volume, both together, called the functional residual capacity, the maximum volume of air that can be expired after normal tidal inspiration, is called the expiratory capacity. Then, what is the total lung capacity? Total lung capacity are the sum of vital capacity and the residual volume, which means it includes all the four volumes, as mentioned in the last video. Obstructive lung diseases like asthma, emphysema, COPD homeopathy helps with remedies like Antum Tart, Ipecac, and Arsenicum album for wheezing and breathlessness. Restrictive lung diseases like interstitial lung disease, pulmonary fibrosis, scoliosis. In homeopathy, we can use calcarea carb, beryllium and silicea help with tightness, shallow breathing, and lung stiffness. In homeopathy, remedies are chosen based on individual symptoms. If you want to know more about topics like this, comment below. And don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. We'll see you in the next video.